Sorry, I'm late. I was just getting my lunch. So, let's get started, okay? Are you comfortable? Have you had lunch today yet? Okay. Okay, you had 11 o'clock lunch. Got it. Good. Okay, so your homeroom teacher um, is telling me your parents are getting a divorce. Um, so, how are we feeling about that? Yeah. Ooh. Mm-hmm. That sounds a little rough. Mm-hmm. Okay. So you're gonna be li living with your mom? Okay. And your dad? No. Joint custody? Okay. Do you think you're gonna go on weekends? Is your mom's house nicer? Um. <laughs> Alright guys, cool, cool. Uh, today, we're gonna be running the mile. Ashley, you look fine to me. You don't need to go to the nurse. Alright, fine. Whatever, go, go. Jessica, why do you need to go with her? Fine, whatever, just go. All right, uh, the rest of you, make sure your tennis shoes are on, make sure you're good, head out to the field, and I'll meet you there, all right? Cool, let's go. All right, first group, ready, go. Hey, Susie, Susie, I see you running through the grass. Stop, just, come on, put some effort into it. What, you're getting cramps? What? Oh, all right, guys, if one more person asks me to go to the nurse, I'm gonna lose my, I'm, I'm gonna lose it. I can't do this. Yeah, can you just order me like a tuna salad for lunch or something? Okay, thanks. Excuse me, Ashley, come over here. Is that a sleeveless top you're wearing? Uh, don't talk back. Don't talk back. Do you realize that that is a major distraction for the other teachers here? Mm-hmm. Three fingers up. Yep. I'm sorry. It's not going to cut it. No. Uh, look, I know a lot is going on with your mom and dad right now, but it's not an excuse. All right. So who do you want me to call? Mom or dad? Because they need to bring a change of clothes. Okay? All right. Come on. Let's go. What is that noise? Excuse me, are you the substitute for Miss Jensen's class? Excuse Ladies and gentlemen, you are at a 10 right now. You need to be at a two, okay? I realize that Miss Jensen is not here today, but that doesn't give you an excuse to act like buffoons. Mm-hmm. Do I need to take over this class for a second? All right, let's do roll call real quick. Let's see, McKinsley. Okay. Ashley. Okay. Matthew. Um, jo Joe's way. Jo Jose. Jo Jose. Okay. My apologies. Um, Mark. Excuse me. Two feet apart. Thank you. My goodness. Boys and girls, I've stopped the music for two reasons. One, the music selection that you have chosen is not appropriate. I gave you the benefit of the doubt that you would choose appropriate songs for this dance, and that's my bad. So I will now be monitoring the music. Second, the dancing that I am seeing is completely inappropriate. Matthew, two feet apart. I see you, okay? I do not want to see any more twerking. I do not want to see any more of these TikTok dances you're doing. And I do not want to see any close, inappropriate dancing. Okay? Thank you. What is that? Martha, is there a reason why someone is parked in my assigned parking spot? It's guidance counselor Sarah. Martha, turn on the loudspeaker. <clears throat> Attention faculty, attention faculty. If you own a red Volkswagen parked out front in the- Good morning, students. I know we are all very, very excited about today's assembly, but before I welcome our guest speaker here today, there's a couple of things I need to address. Your behavior at last Wednesday's Students Against Destructive Decisions assembly was not acceptable. Miss Jensen's seventh grade class. While we were in question time, your questions were completely inappropriate. Matthew, it was not okay to ask if a driver would yeet out the window if they were rear-ended by a semi-truck. That was not okay, it will not be tolerated. Now without further ado, let's welcome our guest speaker, Mr. Johnson. Oh, hey, 
girl. Mm-hmm. Yeah, sit down. <laughs> I know. That assembly was just... <laughs> and I told them that. Mm-hmm. Well... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, girls. Mm -hmm. And aren't those the kids who completely disrespectful? Mm -mm. Excuse me. One, two, three. Eyes on me. Thank you. Okay, does everyone have their chaperone with them? Chaperones, please raise your hands. Jessica, Jonathan, Thomas, Susie, Amber. You're gonna be with Ashley's dad over there. Is everyone in a group? Okay, thank you guys for coming and volunteering with the kids. I know they're a little bit of trouble. It is a privilege, a privilege to get to go on these field trips. Please keep in mind that your color-coded class t-shirts have our school's name on it, okay? You are representing our school when you walk inside of this museum, okay? Okay, everyone, here are the packets that I will be handing out later after the trip to the museum. Okay, guys, there's about 50 questions in this packet. We will be filling it up. Matthew, not right now. Put it away before I take it, okay? Put it away before it's mine. Okay, I'll be handing I'll be right down. Hi. How are you, sweetie? Mm-hmm. Oh, my God, why are you stressed out? Miss Jensen? What did she do? Come here. You need to report that to administration. What she's doing in this. Hey, thank you so much. Oh my god, you're a doll. <laughs> yeah, sit down. Oh my god. Did you hear? Ashley's parents are getting a divorce. And she's gonna live with her mom. Yeah, well, it's joint custody, but, and you met the, you met the father, yeah. Well, that's what I said, you know. I was talking to Miss Jensen about it. I mean, it's, it seems really messy. Yeah, crazy. I mean, the dad was kind of hot, but I know, it's so crazy. <laughs> oh my goodness, excuse me, Martha, yeah. Um, do you think you could, uh, fax this over? It's, um, Miss Jensen's class report. And that's what I said. Those kids will not learn. They cannot res- That's what I said. Mm. Yeah, I can give you the key for it, too. Sorry. <laughs> so many. <laughs> no worries. This one should be at. <laughs> I'm here, I'm gonna do a little bit of an evaluation. I'm gonna be here in the back, okay, guys? So we all need to be quiet and continue to listen to Miss Jensen, okay? Excuse me. I'm sorry, Miss Jensen. Please continue. Hello? Right or look straight at the side My mind's gone in circles I'm trying to